So traders right now, are we developing a bit of a bear flag in one of the main indices right now? It's really interesting. Here's a quick little update. Let's get straight into it. Don't place a trade based on what you're seeing in this video because there is no guarantees of making a profit in the market. It takes you a long time to become a good trader. So this video here is just to educate you to become a much better trader. Alrighty traders, uh, make sure you grab access. If you do need help with your trading class, see that free trading course on the screen right there. Make sure you go get free access to that trading course right now. First link in the description. And now, by the way, guys, when you do get access to the free trading course, uh, the very first video, I've got some, I've got a bit of a special announcement to make that I'm doing. So anyway, you will see what I mean when you go over there. Um, now, traders, is this a bear flag? If so, we could be getting ready for more downside. So here's the thing, guys. Okay, here's the thing. What I'm always doing when I'm looking at these markets. Right now, I'm looking at the Dow Jones. Okay, so right now, right. We only can trade with what we're seeing right now, okay? But we always need to be alert of trend change, different patterns that are forming, potentially forming, and what that means, right? So what I'm talking about here is this. Right now, as I speak, the trend is still up, okay? So the trend is still up, so therefore, the trend is your friend until the end, okay? So, but what we're looking at here is we're looking at the fact that we had this low, high low, high low, and now another high low here, okay? So we're having these high lows to the upside. But again, so that's that's what's happening right now. And we only can trade with what we got right now. Now, by the way, traders, if you, um, if you don't have any trading system you're using right now, you're just using my videos to look for the, for the next quick tip, you are going to go backwards, I promise you, okay? Don't do that, okay? If you want longevity, it's about having some sort of foundations of what we're looking for, some sort of rules, rule-based systems, right? And again, it doesn't have to be many rules and it doesn't have to be using a thousand indicators. In fact, majority of the time, guys, I'm just using this here as my entry, right? I'm, hard, I'm not even using volume. I don't even, I don't, I'm, not, I'm not even looking at, like, so for example, today. Today, I got into a trade today and majority of my entry came from the chart. Just it, that's it, just chart. I have one moving average on there, but the moving average didn't really make any difference to me. So it really was just the chart pattern. And then once you understand that, that's when you can really simplify and really move it up from there. Again, if you're interested in learning that, again, when you go register for the free trading course, the very first video you're going to get is I'm gonna walk you through my trading system that I use when trading the markets. And you'll see how that how simple it actually can be when trading the markets. Anyway, so the purpose of me bringing you back to what I was saying before about the Dow Jones and any market out there, right, is that I'm always looking at what is but what could be building as well too? Because I need to be alert, right? I need to be alert at all times of what's going on. So right now, we're developing low, higher low, higher low, and higher low. But as I started off with the with the, with, the, with today's video, is this, okay? Let's go to one year worth of data. Are we developing something different here? Is this like a bit of a bear flag formation forming right now? Now, I'm not saying that it is, right, guys? I'm not saying it is. But if I bring up, let's actually now add a couple of different layers here. If this is a bear flag, I'm not saying to these guys, okay? Because right now, and, and as I said before, guys, right, there's two different levels here. One, what's happening right now is we're in an upward trend. So therefore, we're now, we're likely to continue up. But what if the market, what if the market changes tune, right? Which it does all the time, right? We go from uptrends to downtrends, the sideways movements to you name it, okay? So, but what if the market does change? Let's say we, we we need to be alert of that, don't we? We really we really need to be alert of what is what that actually means in the market, right? So now we can see low, high low, high low, and now another high low through here. So, but if I bring up all my trend lines now and I can see where we're at, I can also see that this major level of support and resistance all through there is also this point through here. So. I'm not saying this is going to be right, but this, this, the, the, there is a high probability of this actually continuing up and doing this here. But what if, what if that doesn't happen? What if we continue to see this being this, this thing, this thing being developing, and we're developing now something like this here, right? Where we're going to go in sideways, and we start to develop a bit more of a sideways pattern, and then suddenly we get like a big, big strong breakdown bar like that, right? Or maybe even something like that. What happens if that happens? What does that mean to the market then? And we need to be alert of this, right? Because no one knows definitely what's gonna happen. My goal or, or my view is that the S&P 500 is gonna make an all-time new high by the end of this year. That's always been my view. But 
right now on the short term looking at the Dow Jones, what if this what if this does fall? What if we don't continue going up from here and we start to develop this? What does that actually mean to us, right? Because again, we need to be alert. Um, and what that actually means is a, is a couple of different things. Firstly, we're now breaking out of two major levels of support. We're developing this sideways range through here. And then thirdly, if we get a breakdown bar like that, we're also developing a big head and shoulder formation in the markets. Massive head and shoulder formation right at two major level of support. If this gets broken, we could see a big, big, big movement on the downside. This is a, so guys, we just, we just we just need to be alert on that, okay? We just need to be alert on that. And if that does happen, guys, you measure from the high. So let's actually just do this here, right? So you measure from the, the, the head down to there. If that does happen, guys, we're probably gonna get down, we're probably gonna see a movement down to there. And then maybe, and, and then may, maybe even a movement, movement even more, okay? Movement even possibly down to here somewhere. But we're not there yet, are we? What is happening right now? The trend is up, so the likelihood is we're likely to, there's a really good high probability chance that we're gonna break this level here, right? We're gonna break this level here, and we're gonna continue running to the upside. So that's all that matters right now. But if that does not happen, we need to be alert so we can understand, okay, we're, none of, we're not going up, we're doing this, what does that mean? Okay, so, so we can stay on top of it, okay? So let's go look at the S&P 500 just quickly. The S&P 500 is at this level here, but again, we're just still developing this sideways range through here. Really big sort of sideways range, not really much going on uh, through here. As you can see, we're just really just, just in no man's land. Some people will be looking at this as a shoulder, head, shoulder formation. Yes, but remember I said before, guys, the most important parts to the trend is the lows. Lows, high lows, high lows, an equal low, but it didn't make a higher low, but it didn't break the low, okay? If we get higher lows, we wanna see the low broken to say we're no, we're no longer in an upward trend. So we're still in an upward trend through here, guys. So even if this, this even if you look at this as a head and shoulder formation, um, I wouldn't be too quick to quick, I wouldn't be too quick to click on that short button as this market moves, okay? Move over now through to the uh, NASDAQ as well too. NASDAQ, same sort of thing, just sideways movement, not really much going on. Uh, from there from that perspective. Let's go have a quick look at gold and silver gold right now guys pretty much a nothing day across the gold market One thing I'm really still focusing on when we're talking about flag formations is this weekly chart Is this a weekly bullish flag? Right is this more like a weekly bullish flag from there to there there to there right? Is this like a weekly bullish flag in the market because if it is then guess what we could start to see a movement to the upside from there and then also um, same for silver, right? Silver on the weekly chart, once again, is this developing some sort of maybe pennant, maybe like a flag formation? We are developing this uh, point of low, high, low, and high, low in the market. So we are developing still all this overall movement to the upside. So if this silver does hold for some reason and we do start to continue up, we could, we could we could be getting ready for some really 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 big moves in the markets there. So there we go, traders. Uh, traders, I just want to just let, also let you know that that second link in the description there. I want you to click on that. I'm actually giving away a free trading creation call. Uh, it's a, basically a free coaching call. Uh, so this is what I want you to do right now. That second link in the description. Click on that. Go over. I'm I'm for the first ten people only. I'm celebrating my most successful financial year ever. For the first 10 people only, um, I'm giving away uh, 10 personal one-on-one -on -one coaching calls. On that coaching call, I'm gonna build out your own custom trading plan for you, right? So I'm gonna find out exactly where you are, what market you're trading, where you actually ultimately wanna end up, and then I'm gonna start building like a bit of formula, a bit of a plan for you to develop and help you through that. So for the first 10 people only guys, is gonna get that free, what we call trading creation core plan or trading creation plan core. <laughs> um, and the very first 10 people, I don't know how many people are left, you can see, but when you click on that, Second link in the description, guys, you can go book, a, literally just go straight over, book a call with me, fill out fill out a few questions so I can understand where you're at. So when we're actually on the call, uh, we can actually get to work and I can start to build a bit more of a, a bit more of a custom plan for you 
So you can see exactly what is the what is the steps, what is the plan for you to help you move forward. Very first 10 people only, guys, go do that right now. That second link in the description there, guys, click on that, go over, book a time that suits you best, and then also fill out a few questions so then I know what where you're at. And again, this is free for one hour. And then on our call, I'll find out where you are, the mistakes you're making, the market you're trading, where you ultimately want to get up, and then I'll build like a bit of a plan for you to help you get there faster than you can ever imagine.